So I'm about to start Mulan here. Um, it's a movie I know nothing about. I had no idea that it was even an animated movie. I mean, this is pretty crazy. But that's besides the point. I have no doubt that it will share similarities with the animated movie. I mean, it should. Shit. <laughs> uh, my my one thing, though, is there ain't no Mushu. There ain't no talking dragon with the cute-ass cricket. Man, like, how you not, like, have them in this shit? But you got a bitch from the looks of it that animorphs into a fucking falcon? What the hell is going on here? I'll find out and I'll let y'all know. I'm going to just start. I took some notes. I take notes now. <laughs> um, shit, I don't even know where to start with this, man. I might as well start with the end, with the final, with the final act. Uh, terrible. Fucking terrible. <laughs> it was so bad. Look, I appreciate you doing something different and not making it a shot for shot fucking remake. Like, like I, I commend you. But that don't mean I got to like what you did and that don't make it good because it's different. It's terrible. The final act of this movie is just executed so poorly and it's rushed. I mean, the whole movie is rushed. That's number one. But it, the end of this movie is executed so poorly and there's a character that does a complete fucking 180 that is like, oh, well, that's fucking convenient. Like, like seriously, seriously. Mulan walks in, says like two sentences to this character, and they just completely flip around. I'm like, no, no, you don't get to do that. You don't get to, what, what? This whole movie, this whole fucking movie, you was one way, and now this chick, she convinces you with a few raw, raw lines. And you just completely flip. This is some bullshit. <laughs> now, I'm paraphrasing here, but she says something along the lines of, <coughs> you don't have to do this. It's not too late to make the right decision and be like noble or some shit. And I'm sitting back like, no, 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 no. For this person... It is too late. It is way too late. But then the person sits back and is like, hmm, you know what? You're right. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Now, I'm coming. Now, I know I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming across like I didn't like this movie. I'm just saying the end was bad and it had a rough start. But in the middle of there, I'm like, okay, there's something here. Donnie Yen's in the movie. So there's that. Does he have any action scenes? <laughs> no, because why would he? Why would one of the best martial artists on screen have an action scene? Doesn't make any sense. Jet Li's in the movie. I had no idea until the credits popped up. And then I thought about it. I was like, well, which character was he? I was like, oh, he was the emperor. I had no idea that that was him. This motherfucker, oh. Mulan was fine, like, or that. I'm not pronouncing any of these actors' names because I'm going to just sound like an idiot, but whoever the chick was that played Mulan, she was okay. She did a good job. I mean, she's on she's on screen for the majority of the film. Um, but her little, her little, her like buddies or her team, squadron, whatever the hell, they just people to me, dog. They just people. We don't even get introduced we don't even know who these niggas are. So when they're in peril or something happens, you don't care. We don't care. <laughs> we don't care. <laughs> but seriously, though, the villains of the whole thing. So it's not the Huns, but they look exactly like the fucking Huns. So why not make them the Huns? It doesn't make sense. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. And about the bitch who turns into the Falcon. Well, she's a witch. Apparently, and this is what ruined the whole movie for me. She seems like she should be in like 47 Ronin, that one um, weird samurai movie starring Keanu Reeves, of all people. I was like, she does not belong in this movie. Why is she here? 
But when it's all said and done, I mean, especially for a Disney movie, this was missing charm, humor, a sense of satisfaction, and all of that could have been fixed had you had Mushu and that cricket in there. It's 30 bucks on Disney+. Plus. Do you think I paid it? I'm not going to answer that question. All right, that's up for the viewer to decide. Ooh. Anyways, wait till it comes out for free on Disney Plus in December. All right, you can wait. It ain't going nowhere. Chill out.